I'm telling you what, it is a gold mine for golf, and we found it here in Guymon out at Sunset Hills Golf Course. If you've never played this, let me tell you what, you need to find your way here. Um, a lot of good things happening uh, in Guymon. I want to talk to Mitch Wagner. He's the Guymon City Manager. As we were coming into town, I know we've reported it on this a lot, that casino is getting pretty close, isn't it? That's correct. Uh, from what I understand, it should be open mid to late summer. Okay, mid to late summer. And then you guys have a really great kind of expansion, uh, which is going to be great for the kiddos with that soccer complex. Right. The uh, We're in the final stages of, uh, we'll probably start doing the rough grading on the soccer complex in the next month or two. Uh, but it's a state-of-the-art five field soccer complex wow. with AstroTurf that is designed specifically for soccer. So, Well, good things happening in Guymon, no doubt about that. And if, you've, if you're a golfer and, and you enjoy it, you've probably heard about this golf course because it really is exceptional. Let's talk just a little bit about uh, what's happening this weekend with the Jim Hitch Memorial Junior Golf Tournament. Uh, it has become a staple for not just the people of Guymon, but for the people of the High Plains. Correct. Uh, it's the 48th uh, annual Jim Hitch Memorial Golf Tournament, which uh, we've got we've got kids from all over the state of Texas, um, as far away from Tulsa, Oklahoma, that are coming for it. So, full capacity should be a great weekend. Uh, well, the weather hopefully is playing out for it. You guys have gotten a lot of rain. It's beautiful out here. The greens are great. Let's go back and talk about the kind of the history of this golf tournament. It's been going on for a long time, paying tribute to Jim Hitch, who was in the class of '71, who passed away his junior year. Correct. Uh, I, his fellow classmates, along with some of his family, decided to move along with a, a golf tournament that um, was specific for Jim, who was a, a dedicated golfer, and uh, it's 48 years, and they continue to strive, and kids uh, benefit from you know the, the local play and get to come to Sunset Hills to play, so it's it's been great. Okay, well, let's run down kind of the specifics that's going to be going on this weekend. Uh, can people come out and spectate? Because we've got some of the area's <laughs> best young golfers. Correct. Uh, tomorrow the is the actual kickoff. Right now they're on a nine-hole scramble, which they, yeah. they scramble against the uh, class of 71, and then they do a uh, their first round, and then the drive, chip, and putt, which is the PGA affiliate, will kick off tomorrow afternoon. So come out and watch. We've got bleachers set up. They can do it. All right. Very good. Well, uh, Mitch, I appreciate everything. I know you guys are doing great things here in Guyman. Make sure that you keep us up to date on the progress and the great things that are happening here. Um, especially with that casino being built. I know a lot of people are talking about that. So we appreciate you and, and good things happening and good, uh, good things happening here in Guymon. Great, great people to do it with. We appreciate you. We've got more Studio 4 coming up after this. If you are doing some entertainment,